so, hi YouTube, um, okay, so today is Saturday, my turn over day is on Friday, today I'm eight weeks one day, um, and I really quick want to talk about my third week, which was, um, the day of my beta, so the day of my beta, August 27th, that was three weeks, and, um, I started bleeding a little bit. And then, so they gave me my news and I was, I, my beta was good. I, I forgot what it was. I'll write it. So my beta was good. Then came Monday, I had a second beta. And I was freaking out because I was still bleeding a little bit. And um, it went up to 329. I remember that number. And so they said everything's good. And I was like, oh, a lot of research about bleeding and early pregnancy or whatever and then um I kept bleeding and I was cramping as well um they weren't like really bad like AF cramps but they were cramps so um I ended up going to the emergency room and had a UTI and so um they gave me a um medicine um to take for five days and the bleeding actually stopped <laughs> So, I asked my doctor if the bleeding was related to the UTI, and she couldn't, like, say positively that it was, but the correlation, it was a correlation to, um, the bleeding stopped once, um, I started taking the pills to get rid of the UTI, which was really weird. So, that was my <laughs> week three, and, um, so week four, five, and six. Um, there wasn't really too much going on. I was just really, really tired. This last week, though, was bad. I mean, not just tired, but I was really, um, I had to use the bathroom a lot. So the seventh week, I've been extremely tired, and, um, I don't feel like myself. Um, I use the bathroom, like, every five minutes. I have to go now. It's so bad. I swear, every time I go, I just have to go right, right away again. And, um... That's it. Oh, my taste buds. Um, my taste buds, like, I don't know what happened to them. They kind of went away or something. I've been trying to eat things to, like, give it spark. Like, sour can like candy gives it spark. Something sweet or pineapple. Um, but sometimes I eat food and it feels like I'm just swallowing it. So, um, um, I don't want to sound like I'm complaining. Because <laughs> I'm not complaining, I'm just it's just different for me um my body's all already sensitive so i feel like um now that i have another body growing inside of me it's just all out of whack um so um yeah that's basically it um i have my first i was released from the fertility clinic and i have my first um midwife appointment um a day before my nine weeks and I'm having one baby. I said that already, I guess. Um, that's it. There's not really much else besides I'm just so tired. And, um, and yeah, that's it. I can't, if I think of anything else, I'll come back. But, um, I think that's really what I wanted to tell you. Oh, and I've been reading this book. I'm pretty sure everyone's seen it. What to expect when expecting. Um. Yeah, so that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Talk to you soon again. Bye.